Om Shanti. Welcome to 29th of January. It's called Ilbasing. To show a glimpse of happiness on our face with a spiritual smile is what Supreme Father wants us to do. So he says in this beautiful blessing, may you be a special soul who shows a glimpse of happiness on the face through the spiritual smile. The speciality of Brahmin life is happiness. Happiness means a spiritual smile, not something which is faked, like which is done in the corporate sector right now, in the present days, where you have to fake a smile even if you don't like what your boss says. You have to fake a smile even if you don't like how the customer speaks to you. You have to fake it. But if you are content from within, if you are really content from within, if you really know yourself, if you are a very powerful being, if you are complete wholesome from within, in your thoughts, then what other people say won't affect you. Then you don't have to fake it. You'll be having merciful smile. Even if somebody is shouting and screaming, you'll be like, poor soul. And you'll have a merciful smile. Happiness means a spiritual smile. Not to laugh out loudly, but to smile. You can't laugh out loudly when somebody is demeaning you and all right but you'll have a smile on your face because you're wise enough you understand that soul is ailing with weaknesses that soul is ailing with negativity that soul is ailing with a lot of insecurities and unhappiness so you'll have a peaceful face and a smile even if someone insults you let no wave of sorrow appear on your face but remain constantly happy hearted even if someone insults you, let no wave of sorrow appear on your face. Is it possible to do? Yes. If we are on a daily basis meditating, in that meditation, what do we do? We connect to God. Expect all our expectations. We leave it only on to Him. And nothing from this impure old world, where even every soul has become impure, including ourselves, but we are moving towards becoming pure by not following them or not by becoming like them. That means not using their negativity we are trying to overcome the negativity do not think that one spoke for an hour and i simply said something for a second that person sh told me so many things for an hour but i could only speak for one second i only could reply back for one second i should have been able to reply back for another one hour equivalent to that person i should have been given a chance to shout at him or tell him off no even if you did say or thought something for just a second and there was unhappiness on your face that means we got affected by what they said you failed you can imagine god's god wants us to reach that level of purity and strength and power that we should not fail even if somebody is shouting screaming and that is like tolerating something an hour and then that gas comes out of the balloon that means we're tolerating tolerating and then we're not able to take it anymore and we like we spill out the beans Special souls who have the aim of having an elevated life do not become such gas balloons. We don't burst out. How do we do that is what we learn in Brahma Kumaris and that's the practice which all of us are doing and moving towards. But with self-love, knowing the self, increasing the power and wisdom through knowledge which is given at Brahma Kumaris. Om Shanti.